Hey guys, just some stuff to show off. Uh, got a box from Texas Jim. We're doing a trade. He sent me a U-Haul, which I am thinking is an Abus. He used a Schlage blank. An Abus uh, A7240 with the Yale Keyway. A Yale Challenge Lock that he pinned up. I'm interested to see what's inside of it. And a WB with a key. So thank you very much, Jim. Um, got some stuff today from RJ. Uh, we did a little bit of a trade as well. He sent me a WB and a Sergeant. This is beautiful. Uh, along with a couple Schlage latches. I'm going to uh, get him blanks for this Russ win. And it's, this is a Sergeant. Now I can rekey this. I'm going to see what he wants to do. Because I have pre-cut keys. I think that's an LA keyway. Or I can just give him blanks and he can make his own uh, pinning up. He's got the pins there. Um, all original it looks like. And uh, from eBay... I got these, I uh, got two of these Yale cylinders. Uh, these are Yale knob cylinders, old stock VH keyway. Uh, I'm going to, I have one keyed up and then the other one I think I'm going to make into a challenge lock. I haven't quite decided yet if I could get this key out of here. Yeah, let me just get the other one so you can see the keyway. So I did pin this up, but uh, right now it's the same as the other one. So I'm probably just going to, uh, Rekey it, so that's a pretty pretty crazy key with hard to tension that. Uh, and I did a trade with a friend on the Padlock Collector's Facebook page, Mark Rosenthal. Always good to trade with. He sent me this Medico cutaway. Uh, the cuts are the same as the other one I have, but it's a different keyway. This is the S1 Commercial, which uh, technically any Medico dealer can cut. It's not restricted to any uh, specific dealer. And last, I promised uh, in my last video I would show this uh, for Potty and whoever else is uh, working on sergeants, but you have this pin here, and I have a plug follower that was specially modified. It had this notch cut in it, um, so all you do when you're working on this is slip the follower on like that, it passes over the notch, and you just take the lock apart. Uh, very easy. This one I have, uh, this is not modified, but it also will, will fit over, but it's a little loose. Uh, I like this one better. And um, it's much easier than trying to use a standard follower and use a shim or try to take that roll pin out with a hammer because you're probably not going to get it back in. But this is uh, a Sergeant Original Cylinder. I want to say this is for their 8-line levers and knobs. Uh, don't quote me on that. Um, but I hope that's helpful. Thanks for watching and check out keypicking.com.